If you want to be whisked away to a totally different world, I would recommend picking up one of the Splatoon games. The second in the series of this game was released in January of 2017. Taking place about two years later, players lead the charge as Inklings in a pseudo-war mission type adventure to accomplish various goals that lead to defeating Octarians and restoring the city of Inkopolis. It takes the genre of objective-based shooters and puts a sassy spin on it. The composers that worked on this game are Toru Minigeshi, Shiho Fuji, and Ryu Nagamatsu. With a wide variety of musical experiences between the three of these Nintendo veterans, they come together to produce a soundtrack that includes rock, dance, and pop synth music. Today's track comes to you from a duo given the in-game name of Off The Hook. A huge thanks to these awesome musicians, both in and out of the game, for the awesome music. We'll be looking at Ebb and Flow from the multiplayer battles in today's episode of Stick To Games. Kenny Jr. here, welcome back to Stick to Games. Today's number comes from Splatoon 2, Ebb and Flow. This is gonna serve as our introduction to the techno, the electronic synth pop music. Really close to J-pop, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. This one stood out to me because it has some really cool hi-hat play. You notice in the sheet music, you see that quarter note bass, that pounding kick drum. I'm sure we've all heard that in the electronic types of music. and our snare pretty much stays on two and four with the exception of those eighth note and 16th note buildups that I'm sure we've all once again heard in techno music. So this one's gonna be a lot of fun. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, so let's go ahead and jump into the hi-hat part. Um, as you can see, we have a lots of open and close and we even add a diddle on beat two of each measure. Just about every measure here has that. Once you try to take this up tempo, you are definitely going to be needing to rely on that left ankle of yours. So I sure hope your body is ready. Let's go ahead and give that a try at a very slow tempo. You may have noticed that I held my right hand out forward a little bit and moved my left hand in underneath it. I'm prepping myself to practice with the snare drum part. I need to have my left hand ready to use the snare beat on two and four. That's how it's gonna make it the most easiest for me to perform my diddles. So the first transition, four sixteenth notes and a quarter note, just very easy. I like to think of food, watermelon pie. So that means at the end of the hi-hat and kick drum section, it's going to sound a little like this. And we're going to have one more. You'll notice that we have three sixteenth notes that have the first part of its note rested. Now, fun part, snare drum switches to the only four, bass drum, one, and the and of two. Hi-hat remains the exact same. So let's start slow, and then we're gonna try to pick this one up.
Now we're just gonna really quickly work that build up. Once again, a very trademark part of any electronic techno song. I'm sure you've all heard it a thousand times. Works together really well with the open and close here. So let's go ahead and give it a try. All right, you have a lot of fun elements working here. I'm going to try to run this one top down as close to at tempo as I can. See if you guys can play along with me. Alright guys, and that just about does it for me today. Hope you guys enjoyed learning this one as much as I did. Those open and close hi-hats, I don't know what grabs me about this so much, but I just think it's a whole lot of fun to do. Make sure you drop comments, hit the subscribe button, follow me on social media, tag me in any videos you make. I would love to see you guys use these ideas and what you're doing in real life. And uh, comment if you have a request. Uh, other than that, we're just about through here, so until next time.